Hello and welcome to Ukramedia.com. My name is Sergey Proknevsky and today's tip of the day is solo properties. So without any further ado, let's dive right in. All right, so here we are in After Effects. And as always for this example, I have something extremely simple, my text layer, shape layer, and the background. And by the way, this tip is gonna be extremely fast, but don't get me wrong, I use this keyboard shortcut probably the most. And I mean, I use it so much, it's part of my DNA. So let me show you why. I'm gonna select these, collapse them down, and as you can see, we have so many properties in here. But what if you only want to work on some of these properties? And if you're working like on a small screen or a laptop, it can be a bit congested and just annoying. So how do you select some of these and just solo them? So here's how you do it. I'm gonna select this first one over here, source text, just uh, left click on it, and then maybe the scale one, so hold control, and then left click to select more than one. And then maybe go down to this one and select the color one, so control left click and maybe select this scale here. So control left click again on the scale. So we have some of these properties selected. So how do I solo them and get rid of all the other ones? So how do I do that? And the answer is easy. All you have to do is hit S twice on your keyboard, like so, and there you have it. All right, thank you so much for watching this quick tip. I really hope you found it useful. Make sure you like the video, share it, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and also like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram, and if you're not a member of our mentoring group on Facebook, make sure you join it. It's full of a lot of like-minded people who are hungry to learn and to teach and mentor other people. So definitely join and we would love to see you there. But until next time, my name is Sergey Proknevsky and this is ukramedia.com.